Tyler needs a lot of support, but wants to make his own decisions about his life. He has many people helping him, including his mother, Tony, who is his primary supporter. Tyler, Tyler has multiple disabilities. I think there's 32. He's an overachiever on so many things. Um, and uh, he's now 19 years old. Well, his father left when, like, over 10 years ago, because, you know, having a child that's severely disabled is difficult, and mm -hmm. it does interfere with your life and travels and and things. So, um, his father thought that when he turned 18, he would be free and clear. But what happened is there's actually a law in Nevada that says if a child is disabled, you pay child support for life. Um, Tyler's father did not want to pay child support any longer and so he wanted to try to put Tyler in a home but because of Tyler's medical conditions there really isn't a group home that Tyler would be able to go to and Tyler does so much better here taking care of Tyler is very complex and most group homes would not be able to take care of him the only medical facility that could take him is in Carson City and it's more for kids that are in a comatose state or severely disabled. So his father tried to put him away, but because this law came out of supported decision making, it's the only thing that saved Tyler. Now Tyler would have to agree to be put away. So this law literally saved Tyler and us from um, him going away and being put away. Um, I don't have family, so um, it's not like I could have family, but there were friends that they also had children with VNS or severe epilepsy or uh, serious food allergies or autism. And so they're, they're the ones that I reached out to to form a group that would help me and Tyler making some of the decisions to make sure that I wasn't just using my mommy's heart, that it was logical, um, that I had the power of attorneys filled out so that I could do educational, medical, financial decision makings for him. And it's just fabulous. Uh, I don't have problems with when we're emergency hospitals or San Francisco hospitals or they've all taken the paperwork. So they all understand that Tyler is his own guardian.